Hello everyone, welcome to Anime Expo 2019. I'm here with the creator of Has Been Hotel, Vivian. Hi, how are you today? I'm good, how are you? Very good. No more earthquakes, no more heat yes, strokes, so nothing at all. Oh my Please. god, have you worked nearly with the earthquake? Yeah, that was scary. That was I was crazy. in a Starbucks. Oh, you were? <laughs> yeah, it was talk about, shaking. Talk, talk about the heat. With yeah. a bunch of police officers, and they were like, wow, it's a big one. I, I know your series is very popular. You have a lot of fans here waiting for you to sign their stuff. Please tell me a little bit more about your series, though. Um, the series is about the Princess of Hell um, attempting to redeem her people and redeem uh, demons in hell. Uh, whether or not that is a uh, you know successful endeavor is yet to be seen, but the show is kind of about, it's an adult comedy and it's got a lot of uh, nasty characters, but somewhat lovable as well. <laughs> Katie Killjoy. Yes. <laughs> I love Katie. I'm looking at you, Faye. Yeah. <laughs> She's so good. I love her. I love her so much. Katie Kyojoy will be voiced by none other than Faye Mata, who also voices Aqua in Kanasuba and my personal favorite, Astolfo, in the Fate series. Awesome. <laughs> so, talking about characters, tell me more about your characters, all of them, real quick. Um, my characters, uh, they, uh, they've come from all over, so a lot of them are are uh, you know characters I've kind of like created over the years and I've kind of compiled them into this one project um, so you know some of them are brand new some of them I've had for since childhood so there's kind of got this range of like really edgy but also like a little bit more like subtle um, kind of mixed in and they're just I really like non-human characters so there's a lot of like anthropomorphic characters and uh, monster characters and demons and stuff okay, so speaking about characters tell me about Angel Dust um, Angel uh, kind of came from my desire to make a character that was just totally crazy, like I could write anything with him. Uh, so he's like this kind of drugged up, like, uh, porn star. So he just has this extra level of just, he doesn't care about anything. No flying so, us. Yes. <laughs> so like, he was kind of my, like, he kind of came from my desire to have a character that was just totally comedy. He's gained so much more depth and, and, uh, and character, and I'm, I'm really excited for his future. Now, talking about you. Your series as a whole, it has gathered a lot of a great long following and a fan base, a huge fan base. But tell me, did you ever thought that your video, the one that became popular, that you ever thought that would explode your career? No. Um, well, uh, I, I had no idea that has been would be as successful as, as it is. Like I, um, I started it with a few, a few friends. Like I've had the characters for years and I loved them. And I was like, you know what? These characters would make a really fun show. Like, so. I decided to, you know, go for it and I wrote it with some friends and I got some friends together to help me board it and I paid them and, and it just exploded into like this real thing and and people are enjoying it so much and it, I would never imagine I would have had a booth at AX. At Adam and Expo. Yeah, yeah, it's crazy. Did you ever, did, now this was originally an, uh, a web series, did you ever thought it was going to be like a TV thing or? Um, well, its future is kind of up in the air right now. Like, um, I, I'm telling everybody that the future really depends on how well it does, you know, upon release. So we're going to release the full episode in October of this year. Oh, and yeah. uh, it'll be a full 30-minute pilot. So it's like a full, complete first episode. Um, but uh, its future is really de de dependent on how well it does. So, you know, we're going we to we're gonna try and, and see what pitching, what, what deals we can get offered, like when in the pitching world. Um, um, so maybe it'll get picked up by a studio, but if it doesn't, or if we don't get a good deal, or you know whatever happens, um, if we do self-continue it, we would do a big, massive Kickstarter to do a whole season versus just another episode. We're not either way. We're not planning on just an episode two. We would do a whole season, but for a whole season, we would need a big budget. So of course, yes. So hopefully, people enjoy uh, what we do for this first episode, so that we can continue making it. Is there a spin-off, like uh, more merchandise, uh, like books, mangas, uh, comics, uh, plushies? I see that you have pins here, you have yeah. shirts, you have caps here. These are awesome caps, look at that quality. I love the shirt, bought Thank myself you. a shirt. So tell me, what else is in the future, aside from shows and, and TV animations uh, in, 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 for this series, or for, for another series? series? Um, definitely, uh, I know the team and I would love to make an art book based on like all the amazing artwork that's been done for the, for the pilot. Um, definitely comics, we're working on some prequel comics, we're working on 
some uh, there, there could be a comic series after that depending on what happens like depending on how well the comics do definitely more merchandise definitely more shirts and pins and uh, uh, and we're we're working on plushies, so yeah. So we're gonna we're angel gonna just plushie have, there. Yeah, we're working on an angel and an Alistair plushie. So I'm super excited to actually have those like be available for sale. To for, be announced, of yes, course. Yes, obviously <laughs> not to be announced. Not yet, but they're in the works. So hopefully soon. So other than Hasbin Hotel, is there anything else in your future? Uh, another series, another comic book, another. What is in your future? Yes, um, I'm actually planning on doing more shorts that are unrelated to Hasbin. So you know, the the more like, th thanks to to merch sales and Patreon support, and and just having more budget saved up, um, I'm starting to squirrel some of that away for for future cartoons um, of all kinds. I know some a lot of people really love my old web comic, so I'm planning a little cartoon with my web comic characters, and uh, and then future other more cartoon series. One of them that we're working on right now is actually set in the Hasbin universe, but it's a completely new IP Take. with a completely new character cast. Wow. So I'm really excited to, to show more of that. Wow. Um, so I feel like fans of Hasbin will really enjoy that one. Wow. Again, so much things soaring to the future, so much things to do. You're so just much. starting off this, and it has explored so much. I I wish you luck on your future, Thank you of course. Thank you so much. Your show, I don't even have to wish you luck. You already have <laughs> Thank I mean, you. Wow. You're, you're again... You're fantastic, phenomenal Thank you. show. I mean, again, if the fans here don't love it, I mean, they love it, Thank right? You. you guys love it, right? Aspen <laughs> <Aspen> Hotel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, it's everything, everything with the show. Everything is possible thanks to the audience, thanks to the people buying the merch and and sharing the show and enjoying the show and doing fan art. It's it's mind blowing for me. It's an it's it's opening up doors for the future. It's and I just want to continue to make as much free content for everybody and and keep sharing these characters and these crazy worlds with everybody. So thank you everyone who has supported the project. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for supporting monetarily. Just everything. It means so much to me. It means so much to the team. And we can't wait to keep making more for you guys. You heard it here, folks. And with <laughs> that being said, you guys, we ran out of time. Thank you so much for watching. And remember to subscribe to Skitsu Network so you don't miss any awesome videos. But hold on, we have a quick announcement. Before we go, I would like to present an awesome autograph giveaway by none other than the Creator Has Been Hotel. Look at that. That is awesome. Who doesn't want to win an autograph? <laughs> All you have to do is follow the instructions down in the description box below. Comment, subscribe, and like this video. Anime Expo is almost over, you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.